Hey, so you're gonna use implicit differentiation when you're given an equation that has a jumble of x's and y's throughout it. Now the rule for implicit differentiation is whenever you differentiate a y, chuck a dy dx after it. So I say this equation here, uh, where we've got a jumble of x's and y's, so we can't use standard differentiation. So we're gonna use implicit differentiation here. So it's exactly the same rules. So I say first we'll differentiate this y here. So we'll derive the y, uh, which is one, and then since we uh, derived a y, chuck a dy dx after it. Now for this one, we're gonna have to use the product rule. So exactly the same as we'd normally do with the product rule. So uh, we'll change the first part of the equation first. So uh, differentiate x is one, and leave uh, y as normal, like the second part as you'd normally do with product rule. Uh, and now, as following product rule, we'll leave the first part of the equation, so the x stays the same, and we'll differentiate the second part. So y squared differentiated is 2y, uh, and now since we changed to y, chuck a dy dx after it. So if you do want to find dy dx, as this question asks for, then you want to combine your dy dx's together, and then turn everything else onto the other side of the equation, and then you'll have solved it. Hopefully this clears up how to do implicit differentiation. Be sure to check out our other videos for more helpful tips.